let's get the part that I've been dreading over with. Good morning, everyone. Happy Wednesday, Wednesday when I'm filming this. Sunday when you guys are watching it, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, hi, my name is Maddie. I make a ton of fitness and lifestyle content. You guys should definitely click the subscribe button down below so you guys can stick around and hang out with me. I upload twice a week, every Wednesday and Sunday. So super duper excited for today's video. Your girl's getting ready to leave to Stagecoach tomorrow. So I want to bring you guys along for a little Stagecoach prep, everything I'm gonna be doing today to prepare for my Stagecoach weekend. Um, I woke up a little late today. I slept in, I'm gonna get ready to hit the gym. It is 9.30 currently. I have a spray tan appointment at 12.30, a cryo and spray tan appointment. Um, and then I have therapy today at three. I had a meeting this morning at nine. So look at us being productive. How exciting. I do have a TikTok and reel that went live um, today. I posted a little outfit inspo for Stagecoach. I will insert it right here for you guys so you guys can get some inspiration for some Stagecoach outfits. Get a little idea of what I'm going to be wearing at Stagecoach. So that is super exciting. I do have a couple things coming in Amazon today as well. So I'll show you guys that whenever it gets here. Um, one of the items is a thing for Stagecoach as well. Plus I have to pack a little bit today. So I'm gonna bring you guys along through the whole process of preparing for Stagecoach. It's a hair wash night as well, so I gotta wash my hair tonight so I can have clean, nice hair. Um, so yeah, it's a little bit of a busy, hectic day, but I thought it'd be fun to bring you guys along on a little day in my life, how I'm preparing for Stagecoach weekend, and all of that fun jazz. So without any further ado, let's get into today's video, and let's go head to the gym. Do you eat your breakfast? All right, I go to the gym and I'll be back soon. I love you. Hello guys, your girl just got out of the gym. I'm going to go head over to my cryo and spray tan appointment. I also want to get a car wash and I really want a smoothie. I woke up, like the last two days, Jacob and I have been sleeping with like the AC unit on and the fan on and so I think that's what's been causing me to wake up with a sore throat. I bought emergency yesterday and I'm taking those like emergency like chewable tablets every day. So this is my second day taking them. I'm taking them to Stagecoach with me just because I don't want to be sick at Stagecoach and I don't want to get sick at Stagecoach. So I'm taking my emergency with me so I can take it every single day just to prevent myself from getting sick. So I'm taking those, but I really just want a smoothie. My throat is killing me. So I think I'm going to go to Jamba Juice and just get like a smoothie with some like vitamin C and vitamins in it um, and then I need a car wash too so I'm not sure if I'm able to get a car wash before the spray tan and cryo or after but we're definitely gonna get a smoothie so that's the plan right now I had a really good workout which I will post on the screen here for you guys you guys will see it it was an intense leg day I did some quads and glute focus day great workout absolutely loved it I will have the full details and everything over on my Instagram page per usual but loved that workout it was quick and easy did my 20 minutes of cardio I've been doing 20 minutes of incline walk after every workout for the past like couple of months and I want to say I've been doing cardio like four days a week on average um some like anywhere between like three to five days a week I guess I'll say because there's some days where I only get three days in which is very rare normally four days is like my go-to and then five is the most that I'll do it but I've been doing that I've been seeing a lot of progress in my cutting so or during my cutting so I've been really enjoying that um so yeah we're gonna get ready to head over to get my smoothie and then head to my appointment and then I will check in with you guys in a little bit Right, guys I got my Jamba Juice I just got a small orange dream machine I literally used to be obsessed with this when I was in like high school um so I haven't had one of these in a while so I'm excited oh my god that feels so good on my throat I'm starving too but I have food that I need to eat at the house so instead of spending money on food because I'm gonna be spending money on food all weekend I'm gonna make a sandwich or something whenever I get home but I forgot that I need to go to the bank. Um, so I'm going to go do my bank stuff I need to do right now. Um, it's 12:10, so I still have some time before my appointment. So I'm gonna go do that stuff and then I'm gonna head over to my appointment after. Um, so I will see you guys whenever I get to my cryo and spray tan appointment. A 
I'm all done at my spray tan. It's currently 1.30. I have Miss Remy in the car with me. I just picked her up from home. We're gonna go to the park so I can get her out. I've like had her at home since like 10 this morning, so I feel bad. I wanna get her out and have her like run around and play. And then I'm just gonna get a car wash here in town. I was gonna get a car wash when I was like near my cryo and spray tan appointment because I really like the car wash there, but I just felt bad I wanted to get home to get Miss Girl. So we are home after the car wash. Remy over here is like dead after the park, guys. That's that's a mood right now. So anyway, my stuff from Amazon just came in, so I was gonna show you guys what I got. One of the things is a business thing. Not gonna be too interested, but I thought I would just open up the packages and see what we got. Okay, I know exactly what this is. I'll still show you guys, even though it's not all that interesting, but. Okay, so I basically just ordered some more of these one by two and a half inch labels for my label maker or my label printer, I should say. So yeah, so I ordered some more of these. I ordered a four pack of them. So that's what came in the mail. I needed those. And then my item for Stagecoach came, which I was freaking out about because I literally leave tomorrow and I was hoping to be here in time, which it was. So I hope it looks good. I'm like kind of nervous so this is what I got I ordered this little like crochet skirt I was really going for like a cute like I don't know like summery vibe with this um, but I got this from Amazon super I think it was like 20 bucks thank god it came overnight but I'm gonna wear this with like a the little like paisley crop top I'm hoping so hopefully this looks cute I'll have to try it on later because I don't want to get my spray tan on it right now I can't shower until freaking tomorrow morning so that's gonna be fun and tomorrow morning is when I'm leaving to go to my friend's house so we can leave to stagecoach that's gonna be fun but I'm glad this came and it looks like it's going to work so I'm gonna make some lunch I'm literally starving it's 2 15 so I have therapy in an hour um so yeah that's pretty much what I'm gonna be doing the rest of the day probably just sit I honestly might sit on the porch it's so nice outside I might just like sit on the porch eat my lunch and do all my work that I have to do. So that's where I will be for the next couple of hours. All right, guys, I think it's time to pack. It's it's 4.30, I just got off therapy. Guys, I am exhausted right now. Like, I can't even explain to you how tired I am, but I need to pack. I'm leaving tomorrow from my house at like 10, 11 a.m. I need to shower and wash my spray tan off in the morning and wash my hair. So I'd rather like do that and like work in the morning than have to worry about packing. So I'm gonna pack a majority of my stuff tonight and then just pack like the things that like I need, you know, tonight and stuff tomorrow. So like, you know, things like my laptop and things like that will be packed tomorrow. So we're gonna get ready to pack. Um, I'll go through a few of my outfits for you guys um, and just kind of like where they're from and stuff while I'm packing. but. Majority is going to be a little b-roll of me packing. I think it's only Right that we listen to the stagecoach 2022 playlist on Spotify while we are packing so I'm gonna turn that on. I'm gonna start packing and uh, Let's get the part that I've been dreading over with Okay, so we've got options for shoes. I'm gonna show you guys um, I'll also tell you guys where they're from because I got a lot of comments on my reels asking like where all my shoes are from and stuff. So basically I'm gonna take these boots which I need to wipe down with a baby wipe. These I got from ASOS. Um, I got these like a year or two ago. They're just these little white pointed booties with some cute little studded detail around the end. I'm wearing these with my Carrie Underwood outfit. It's like an all white vibe um, or like mainly white, like a white like fringe jacket. Um, my white cowgirl hat and stuff. So I thought this would be cute with my white belt too. So I'm gonna take these. I know they're gonna get dirty, but I've already worn them so many times and they're honestly pretty scuffed up. So it's not like I really care about it honestly that much. So I think they'll be cute. They're pointy, give me a little bit of Western vibes. Okay, then I'm taking these cowgirl boots that got sent to me from Boot Barn. Um, I've literally never worn them. They're Ariat. Um, 
They're not the most comfortable because they go up to my knee and I have pretty large calves, which I didn't even take into consideration that I would need a little bit of like a wider boot around the calf because my calves are big. So these are not the most comfortable, but they're still cute. And I feel like once I break them in, they'll be good. They're just an all black cowgirl boot, super cute. Um, and then the next pair of boots, I actually bought these myself from Boot Barn. Um, they just look like this. I've worn these so many times to country concerts, as you guys can tell. What brand are these? Uh, Free to Roam is the brand. They just have super cute like paisley detailing, just some turquoise colors. Probably will wear these in the last day. These are really comfortable. I've worn them so many times, like I said, and I just love them. They're just like that broken in look. So these are like my go-to babies. I love them. And then I'm gonna be wearing my Yeezy slides um, in the car ride there. And that's like the only like pair of like sandals I'm gonna take um that i'm gonna wear like by the pool and like you know if we go like run errands or anything um and the last pair of boots i haven't worn these yet i don't know if i'm even gonna wear these there but i'm gonna take them just in case because i'd rather be safe than sorry so these are like the what is it called like steel toe flat toe boots square toe boots so these ones um jacob actually got me for christmas they literally still have the tag on them but i love them they're just like this light brown color with white detailing so i was originally going to wear these with the carrie underwood outfit but the brown just like wasn't the vibe it did match well so i'm gonna wear the all white ones but i'm still gonna bring these because i'm debating between wearing these ones on the last day or my brown broken in ones i probably will go with the broken in ones because they're gonna be more comfortable but depending on how my feet feel by day three is kind of what i'll go off of so we're gonna take them just in case Okay, so next we have shorts. I'm gonna show you guys the shorts that I'm bringing. So I have these black, just like frayed shorts from Target. These are like literally from high school, but um, I've grown into them now, so we love that. So I'm gonna take these just for comfort in case I want to wear them. But I have a black pair of shorts that I wanna wear with my all black outfit for Thomas Rhett, but they're just not the most comfortable. They're these fringe shorts from Sheen. I don't know if I'll wear them because literally they're so freaking tight around my like butt and then my butt hangs out of them. So. I don't know if I'll wear these, but I'm gonna take these as a backup just in case. So we have those. These I'm wearing on my Carrie Underwood day, which is day two. So the fringe is already coming off of these, which I'm taking Gorilla Glue because I'm gonna glue them back. But I DIY these. The shorts are from Fashion Nova, and then I just added my own bedazzles on them. So I just need to re-glue it on there. Oh my God, they're literally all falling off. So screw my life. But yeah, I'm gonna glue all that back on. So that's for day two. I'm also taking these. These are just some um, American Eagle high-res mom shorts. I haven't worn these one yet, but I'm gonna take them just in case. But the ones that I have worn are these ones, and I love them. They're the same short, they're a lighter denim, so I'm gonna take these also just for comfort on the last day. Okay, and then I also have this, which I showed you guys from Amazon earlier. It's the French cute little skirt that I'm gonna take. I'm actually gonna try it on with the top here in a minute so I can see what it looks like. So yeah, taking this also. Um, so that's the plan, and then I'll show you guys the shirts that I'm taking too. Okay, so my hair looks a little ridiculous because I just have my hat on, but I'm going to show you guys the fit. I'm obviously going to wear boob tapes. So my boobs are going to be like up here, not like down here, but this is the top that I have, and then this is the bottoms. I'll show you guys. So this is the little like skirt, let them fall, from Amazon, which I have a black bikini bottom on underneath, which I don't know if I'm actually going to keep the black one. I have a white one at my mom's house that I might try to grab tomorrow. Um, and try to wear white with it, but I don't think the black doesn't like honestly look bad. So yeah, this is what it looks like. I honestly think it's kind of cute minus the tag. Um, and then this is obviously the top. I think it's a cute little fit. And then I just have these boots on with it. So this is kind of the vibe that I was going for for the last day. Again, um, I'm just going to kind of go off of like how I feel and like what other people are wearing. If I feel like other people aren't really wearing like something cute like this or like, I don't know, this is kind of out of my comfort zone, um, then I probably will honestly just like pair this with shorts like my original plan was, but I thought why not try something new. So I'm gonna take it just in case. But um, yeah, so those are like the bottoms and shorts. Um, I'll show you guys the tops. This is actually one of the tops that I'm gonna be wearing and I'm gonna grab the other ones to show you guys right now. Okay, tops, let's go over them. I look kind of ridiculous right now. Oh my God, people are literally driving by. Guys. I have my window open and people are driving by like staring at me like this is oh my god okay anyway so let's just get this over with before i keep getting stared at so i'm taking this top right here i don't think i'll wear it because i think it'll be too hot but i still want to take it as an option little off the shoulder top it's from sheen literally every single top i'm gonna show you guys is from sheen so is this one um i like this one 
so I can show off my back. So I'm hoping to wear this on the last day, but this is the top that I'm wearing for Carrie Underwood. I've already showed this in a little reel. If you guys want to go check that out, I posted it already. It's on my Instagram, but um, this is the top that I'm going to wear. I like that it just has like the cute little like the dazzling details it ties in the front so yeah this is just what it looks like so that's gonna be my carrie underwood top i'm taking this one which i'm not sure if i'm gonna wear it yet but it's a nice option to have it's this little like cow zip up top oh my god everyone's staring um and then i also have this little like cow print bikini top which i feel like it'd be cute to wear i'm gonna take this to like maybe wear like by itself i don't know i have a pair of like cow shorts that i might take to wear with that or maybe just like black shorts honestly like just to have like the contrasting vibe um i'm taking this top for my friend because i definitely cannot wear it it's a bandana top that ties but it just has like no support it's so cute and i feel like my friend kaylee would be cute in this so taking that just in case for her um this top as well i can't wear because of my boobs but maybe another girl in our group can i always like have options for people so this one is just this like cow fringe top and it literally just like ties in the back so cute i literally wish i could have wore this i'm so freaking pissed i'm so pissed that i can't wear it so i'm gonna take it for someone else just in case because it's still cute and then um this is the one that i wore in my try on haul for thomas rhett it's just this cute little like untamed like um crop tank top i like these because i can wear a bra with them and i'm like comfortable with out of bra i'm not so i like having this option and then i have the exact same top but a different print in case i wanted to go for a little bit of a pop of color it's a cute little, like motorcycle top i don't know i thought that like grungy like motorcycle vibe was kind of cute this top i really want to wear too which i haven't decided what day i'm going to wear this either going to be i'm either going to do this one on the last day or this one i don't know i really want to wear this one though it just gives me like coachella vibes like but still stagecoach because you can like pair it with like some boots and stuff to make it more western i don't know i like it it gives me a lot of support too so um really want to wear this one i'm taking that one for sure hear me out i'm gonna wear it one day um and then i'm also taking these two little like mesh see-through tops which i i'm not gonna wear but um i'm taking them actually you know what now that i think say it out loud i don't think i'm gonna take them at all but i was gonna take these to like wear maybe like a bikini top like on underneath which i still feel like would be a cute vibe but i don't know i feel like if i'm gonna wear a bikini top i honestly should just wear a bikini top and not even worry about wearing a top over it it's just like an extra layer to have on so i don't know this is what it would look like though it would be like this little top. I don't know. Should I take them? I mean, they're not really taking up space. I'm going to throw them in there. Don't think I'm going to wear them though. But yeah, those are my top options. Um, and then my accessories, I'll show you guys those too. These are the two hats that I'm taking. I have this straw hat right here that Jacob got me for Christmas. And then I have this little cheap one from Party City um, that I got like for like a holiday party or something. But um, I like it because I can just like kind of like mess with the top of it a little bit to kind of like reshape it if I need to. But I, bedaz I did my own little like bedazzle string on it. So I'm going to wear this for Carrie Underwood because it gives me like that disco cowgirl vibes so yeah so those are the accessories that i'm taking you guys saw my shoes i'm taking some bandanas as well as well as some swimsuits which my swimsuits are all buff bunny so those are the fits but um yeah let's get to packing everything All right, guys this is the aftermath this little suitcase over here is just like all of my like hair makeup skin stuff i literally always need a separate bag for that stuff and then over here literally my shoes take up the whole left side but it's fine accessories belt all of that swimsuits underwear bras socks all of that and then this is all my clothes i have jackets all my clothes underneath some sweats a hoodie yeah we're pretty much ready to go i have my hats over here which i'm going to carry and then i have an ice chest full of stuff also that i'll show you guys so this is the ice chest um we have white claws we have a lot of new seltzers down here we have a lot of new energy drinks liquid iv to stay hydrated some oatmeal packets for me to eat for breakfast in the morning and then um i have some of my dave's killer bagels as well as some pressed juice which probably needs to be refrigerated but it's fine um and then i'm also going to pack some more snacks in here as well so you think you're coming with me i wish you could
So that is it for today's hectic video. I feel like I've just had a never ending day. I swear my allergies are so bad. My sinuses are literally in so much pain right now. I'm gonna go get some allergy medicine and then I'm gonna make some dinner because your girl's hungry. Jacob is at baseball practice. Um, he is doing a baseball game this weekend. So he's at practice right now. So that is fun. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for all these stagecoach picks. All of my pictures will be currently going up by the time you guys see this video or already up the video this video goes live on sunday stagecoach stagecoach last day is sunday so you guys will have already seen my content and the content that is still coming so i'm excited um if you guys happen to be there please say hi to me i love to meet you guys and i would love to say hi and have some fun at stagecoach with you guys so yeah with that being said i hope you guys enjoyed today's get ready prepping video with me i will see you guys in next time's video bye guys